give a warm welcome for Stephen Craig. really didn't come here to lay down some six beats. I just got up on the stage to do some comedy. I went fishing the other day. <laughs> yeah, that was to wake you up. All right? If that didn't wake you up, guess what, guys? It's a comedy show. One of the most fun things to do at it is laugh. All right? Uh, so I went fishing the other day. You know, one of the two activities total in Key West. Uh, you know, that morning it was I flipped the coin. Heads I drink, tails I fish. But the coin landed in the water, so I picked up my beer and kept fishing. Uh, and when I, when I got back from fishing, I noticed I had a rash on my lower lip. So I did what all guys do when they discover something new and disgusting on their body. And I showed it to all my closest friends. <laughs> so they said, dude, that looks like an STD. And I thought, mm, at least I caught something. <laughs> then I thought, no, it can't be an STD. Because in order to get an STD, you need to be having sex. And boy, oh boy, am I not doing that. So. So they said, you should go to a doctor anyway. And I thought, a doctor, that's a good idea, except that my health insurance is a bronze plan through Florida Blue, so a doctor is not in my coverage. <laughs> right, like the only, the only procedure my insurance will cover is ignoring the problem until it goes away. Which is really ironic, because they really hate it when you do that with their bill. Yeah, yeah right, like the only thing I can afford to do if I'm ever injured is die. Like, that's, all my, that's the only thing in my budget. So I couldn't go see a doctor. I mean, like, I could see a doctor. One could be walking by in the street, and I could go, ah, pop quiz. But, like, I couldn't get a medical consultation. Luckily, my insurance did let me pick which hospital would be my primary care facility. So being a hard-shelled, lock-jawed, pea-brained individual, I picked the turtle hospital. <laughs> Look, all right, see, yeah, nuts, man, but we're not actually gonna touch because germs are really weird. So, but, uh, so, like, the turtle hospital is amazing, all right? The turtles get treated significantly better than people. Okay, look at the amenities of the turtle hospital. Uh, there is free shuttle service to and from the beach. The hospital food is crab and lobster tail. And every room has a complimentary pool, all right? <laughs> Even the diseases at the turtle hospital sound more fun. Like, what are the human diseases? Gonorrhea, syphilis, herpes. You guys catch that? Yes. <laughs> Good. You're paying attention. Please continue. Like, turtles, they come in and it goes, oh, this turtle's butt's floating at the surface. I guess it has bubble butt. I want to get bubble butt. Like, I'm standing up here with white guy ass. Why can't I have bubble butt? Like, even when you leave this hospital, it's better than leaving a people hospital. Like, when you leave the turtle hospital, they invite everyone out, and they carry you into the water like royalty. And then the nurse comes up to you and says, I want you to go out and make babies. Like, what a send-off. In an actual hospital, they put you in a wheelchair, send you out the front door, and then they repossess the wheelchair. I guess, really, when you break it down, one hospital wants you to go fuck, and the other one wants you to get fucked. <laughs> right, thanks. thanks, guy in the back. I got enough time for one more though. Um, I used to have an addiction to masturbation, but guess what? I beat it. Thank you. <laughs> Stephen Crane. 